Hi! In the next few minutes, we'll take a look at some of the highlights in ALM 24.1. First up, Web Client, previously known as Web Runner. The Test Runs module is introduced, enabling you to view results of manual test executions. You can now save your frequently used views as favorites for private or public use. To access a favorite easily, you can organize your favorites into groups. The filter function becomes more powerful with expanded options. You can use it to filter records in tree view, group runs and defects in grid view, and sort entities based on sorting priorities. When viewing requirements, you can now switch between grid and details views. This release strengthens workflows for web client customization. More events are available in project scripts. Advanced project scripts are introduced to enhance the efficiency and accuracy of specific tasks, such as creating, deleting, and updating entities. Web client adds multilingual support. In addition to English, Web Client supports six other languages. Next, let's dive into some updates in Desktop Client. With the Share Homepage permission, you can share your homepage overview by a single click. You can move unwanted items into the Recycle Bin and restore them whenever you want to reuse them. The Recycle Bin safeguards entities from accidental deletion, minimizing the impact of user errors on data loss. Test run purging is enhanced with better performance and user experience. After starting, purging tasks run in the background and you can track them in ALM Task Manager. And now some enhancements in analysis and reporting. In age graphs, you can group defects at custom periods. This update allows you to gain more precise insights into your defect data. When you change the group color in an existing graph, the color can be applied to other instances, such as the same group in a new graph you create. ALM supports OData protocol. This enables you to connect to ALM data using OData C from your business intelligence tool and analyze the data with extended reporting capabilities. Site administration includes more functionalities. The new client management replaces the previous web client admin page, allowing both on-premises and SaaS admins to enable or disable web client and its modules. API key management is now moved to site administration with a fresh look and feel. The new design makes it easier for admins and basic users to create and manage API keys. License assignment has become more simplified and user-friendly for SaaS customer admins. From the License Assignments window, customer admins can perform all license-related operations, including assigning licenses to child customers and viewing assignment details. Now that ALM supports connecting to Microsoft SQL Server using the Azure Active Directory authentication, you can add a database server of the corresponding type. Finally, new REST APIs are available to customize project lists. Check out the Help Center to learn more and enjoy the new ALM release.